I want to be Lucas Burgard, Matt. You be meeting new friends. This guy swings it like how you dream that you swing it. Oh, one of them, is it? Yeah. <laughs> dream swing. It's, it's man crush. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna do a little video. What can you learn from Lucas's swing? We're gonna I'm gonna show you what I can learn from it and what I wish I learned when I was younger. This guy tonks it. <laughs> Send it. Bro. Oh man, oh Lucas. <laughs> Get another. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, Coach Loggy here and welcome to the video. This video is going to give you an insight on how one of the top European golfers in the world hits it as far as he does. Up here in the pole, do you wish you could hit it further? And just before we get back to the video, if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. If you are subscribed, make sure you ring the bell and you'll get all the notifications of when we upload a new video. So if we look at his swing, perfect posture, like it's beautiful posture. Yeah. He's, Adam Scotty. Yeah, like and he, he's, he's full in figure and tall. Yeah. Like he's a good Danish specimen. Be a model. Bro. Um, as, yeah, <laughs> as, as he pulls back, he gets a little funky with his left foot, which I think is quite fun. Yeah. And then as soon as he starts down, his left foot comes up, which I think is great. High hands. Um, hot hands so high on the way back. Yeah. Loving the stretch. Everything looks a little really neat. Hits generally a little cut, the shots I was seeing him hit. I don't know if that's his stock shot, but I followed him for a few hours and he was hitting a little fade was yeah. what he wanted to do. Pretty straight to a little kind of fall out the air to the right. Look at this squat as he comes down. I mean, that Whoa. is... It's a tiger squat. Yeah. And so many people, when Tiger was having obviously issues with his life, tried to blame it on the squat on telly and stuff, didn't they? Yeah. I, I don't know if anyone's ever still apologised for their ridiculous <laughs> comments about squatting. So he literally compresses into the ground, like just pushes in and then lifts off, jumps, left foot comes out. Power. Through he goes. But he does it into a very balanced follow through. So you get this kind of brilliant mixture of ridiculous thrust, squat, and jumps. Yeah. Which is like, you know, it's like aggressive. Yeah. But it's hidden in this package of, of like elegance. Beauty. But when you break it down and look at it, he's like really pushing and pulling yeah. like super aggressively. Can we swing like Lucas Berger? <laughs> I think I do. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> my swing is beautiful. Yeah, so I've got a five iron here, right? This is my five iron, six iron, but it's a five iron in my set. Yeah. I'm just gonna hit my iron, I'm gonna try and find a green shot. I've hit that pretty nice. Let's put it out there. Lucas is probably getting his five iron carrying 209, 210 if he wants. Yeah, I reckon. Mine's so. carried 185. So I'm hitting this five iron like a 195 club max. Yeah. 190, 185. So my um, club head speed there, ball speed on a decent hit was 124. And my club head speed was 86 with my five iron. 4 and 86. So I'm now going to. Beer guard it. Beer guard it with finesse looking No, I styles. can't do that as well. I've Can you not? Got, I've already got... But you're, you're meant to try and be him. Yeah. Not sure I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'm going to do, I'm going to try and get my hands as high as possible. Yeah. Because for me, I'm so safe compared to where he is stretching yeah, the yeah. world. I've gone 10 finger grip just for the added support for speed, making you feel more comfortable. So I'm not going to be afraid if I let my left foot just come up a little bit. So big turn, big stretch. And then the downswing, I am going to feel like there is sponge, ball, jello, I don't care what's under that foot. I am going to squidge it out and then jump off it. Yeah. Right? Feels a little bit like standing on a stingray that I, st I stood on. <laughs> you stood on Yeah, it got me. It stung me. Really? Yeah, and when we were up. Never the told me that. So you meant the shuffle. They say do the stingray shuffle when you go out. Yeah. They move. Yeah. They yeah. sat on the base. But I like took up the steps and tried to push on my board and I felt something squishy. Oh. And I stood and you feel it instantly, you like push off as quick as possible, but his, I felt his spike come up and he just got me in the oh. heel. Like it stung, but I like properly dad that, you know, I dadded it up right. <laughs> didn't want to tell the kids because I'd never have gone back in. <laughs> yeah. So I was literally like, yo, oh. it felt like I stood on a rock, a real jagged rock had gone right into my foot, oh. but it was there. Anyway, no. Well, yeah. Back survived it. Well, uh, well done, you. I heard once that Lucas stood on a stingray and he cried. <laughs> <laughs> he, he crushed it actually with so much power. <laughs> he got out of the sea, didn't surf again, and cried on the beach. That's what I heard. It's just, it's just a rumor. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, back to trying to hit it with power and finesse. I can't do either. Here we go. High stretch. 
squat push jump out. Oh, I, could, I could jump better than that. I could jump better than that. I reckon that's quicker though. Ball speed one, two, four, no quicker. Oh, okay. speed? Speed. 90. Yeah, it's quicker. Strike let you down. Yeah, so smash is down because obviously I'm strug I'm struggling to do those movements that feel so different to me. Yeah. And keep all the other elements of delivery there. Yeah. Which is a great message for so many. I'm gonna do another. I reckon I could get down and up more. So my left you foot lost went your, there, which lost your did. sexiness on the follow through. Yeah, there. well how do they do it? Yeah, yeah. 94. Whoa. 94. Boom. But I'm still only going ball speed of one. That is one eight yeah, one. It's yeah. no further. Strike again, high that yeah. time. Yeah, and I, I don't know what lofts I'm presenting and things like that. So that's the beauty of what you see these players doing. And I think as well, this isn't something so much that Lucas has learned. We can learn from him. Yeah. So I would apply this to students who want to get better at any level. But certainly when it gets to elites and they're looking for that little push, like yeah, like Lucas is able to send it out there a bit more than you because look how he's using the ground or moving. He did this. Like I, I reckon this would have been something he just did. It's how he's, he's worked it out. It, yeah. So it, it's you know it's the skill. How old is he? Is he a younger generation? I don't know. I don't know. How old I thought he, he looked old. Old. <laughs> 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 old Ag cries I when thought, he gets oh, stung. I thought he doesn't like stingrays and he looks older <laughs> than he should be. Because no, he might he's be. He's young, I don't know his age. I'll put it, maybe someone can comment down yeah. and tell us how I like, look at I reckon he's 24. So five. he's like the pound it generation, isn't he? Correct. It? So Correct. It's that, that generation of. I know if I was starting golf tomorrow, I'm I'd be happily trying to get my swing speed with this up to 100. Do you reckon I can get to 100? Yeah. Oh, mm, maybe. That sounded a better strike that Sounded time. one, yeah, one, yeah, one, two, nine ball speed. Yeah. 92, not as quick. Not as quick. But my smash went up. Yeah. So I can get my five iron going to one, nine, five, or oh, sorry, to 95 mile an hour ball speed. Yeah. So I reckon I could get my five iron going to 200 yards. Yeah. Could I play golf like that? Well, I could, but I'd have to relearn. Yeah. So I'd like to be doing this, you know, when Lucas started. Probably started when he's too old as well. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I see this sort of lesson um, with students that are like, are peaked. And yeah. you think, you're not getting better. Yeah. You need to win it 20 yards further now. And you've got learn to, to do it. Yeah, yeah, and learn to do and, it. And that's what I love, all seriousness about this, is that as a coach, I've always done it. How are they doing this? Yeah. Because my thought as a selfish player is, why can't I do that? Yeah. And I think the more coaches, you know, your best coaches love doing this because they want to know how, are they, how is he making that move and pushing down and squatting like that? What's it doing for him? And I can see, I mean, what did that give me? 10 mile an hour club head speed. 10 miles an hour. With a driver. 25 to 30 yards. With a driver, yeah, 30 yards. Through the air. <sighs> So 100%, you start me again as yeah. a 12 year old, this is my game. And that's you not doing what Dan does. What's Dan doing? Okay. Dan just plays every day, doesn't he? Squat. <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> Dan! Oh, he's, he's playing, Dan. In, playing in a medal today. <laughs> Golf again. Yesterday, <laughs> pro-am. Never stops. Right, let's see. Golf so no, I want normal best. trying to yeah. find a uh, target. You just want speed, basically. I want you? ball speed because I want to see how good you are. Do you see what I mean? You see, my ball yeah. speed struggled to go up, even though my clubhead speed could. What have you got? I've got seven iron, 91 yeah. speed clubhead. 91 clubhead. And 121, I think it's uh, uh, 117 ball speed. So 120. One carry. What was your clubhead speed? 91. 91, yeah. So you've got good speed. Yeah, you know I have, this. yeah, yeah. Right, can yeah. you? So I want 100 mile an hour seven iron from you. Oh, yeah. A little bit, and then he's like, You got to jump out of it, yeah. Squat and jump. I want to make it look good too, though. That's the thing. You, you could do that, I reckon. Bang and whack. Oh, I didn't go down enough. No, you didn't really jump out. What no, were we getting on that? What club head speed went to? 93, two miles an hour quicker. Yeah, so I, you need that. to be aggressive with yeah. your squat and jump. Yeah. So I, I was very willing to miss the ball. Yeah. I just wanted to squat and jump and see what it did. Oh, You're not jumping out of that, are you? I, well, you watch my feet, I reckon I am. What have you gone to? 96. 
So what were you first? So you've gone up five. 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 So I've got ten mile an hour yeah. in me. Come on. You are a seven iron, so in theory you've got a little less, but it's not much. Oh. Yeah, you jump then. Get down and up there. <laughs> so ball speed's now 97.9, that's 98, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Do you see what I mean? That's brilliant. <sighs> yeah, yeah. I don't know how these long drive guys do it. No, absolutely. That's four shots, yeah. so I'm sweating. But think about it. You go and put Lucas in our frame because I can only go as fast as I can slow down. So if I go at his speed, my body will probably go, you shouldn't have done that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, clubs coming out, like yeah. you're breaking, pulling yeah. muscles, everything. So it doesn't you? mean I can't go at that speed, it means I would need to do this. Yeah, yeah. So then my body would go, yeah, I can handle that speed because I can put the brakes on and it's not going to pull your arm out of your socket and hurt a muscle and yeah. do all those kind of things. But absolutely all day long, I go on tour range after tour range and I see... But you look at Molinari doing it now. Yeah. He's doing the old foot up drills on the range and Again, stuff. Like, Again, like, I'm he? sure he says to himself, if, I, if I'd have done this when I was... Yeah. Like, I don't want to be doing this now in front of you on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wanted to have done this... 12 at Stover every summer holiday that I'm out there for five weeks, six weeks of the year practicing every shot. Yeah, yeah. This is when I wasn't practicing and that's, it does upset me. Yeah. I'm upset. Lucas has upset me now. <laughs> I used to like him. As beautiful as he is, like, <laughs> he's upset, yeah. He wants to go surfing and just, you know, get this, deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going for that. Up and squat, bang. It's addictive, isn't it? Yeah. It, I mean, it would make me want to learn again. If I wasn't as busy, like if I, golf was my thing, I would kind of quite like the challenge. How quick and how low can you go? Well, how bad will I become mm. hitting shots like this? So this is golf from now on. You know, the left-handed challenge we did, it would be quite fun, wouldn't it? Because he's not full out in there either in no, his well, video, No, well, the biggest thing that Sean told me, his caddy, which was really interesting, he said it's so interesting working with a player who can carry it 30, uh, 309 off the tee, yeah. so he can do it, but he's more than happy to hit seven iron soft. He said that's not always the case. He's from the other bags he's been on with other players and players he sees, they're pounding everything. Yeah. But Lucas can do that, but he can also, he's happy to hit it. finesse. A, yeah, and I saw him hit it on the walkthrough. That if you haven't seen the walkthrough, I'll put a card up here for the walkthrough yeah. uh, that we walk with him. He does hit a few little approach shots, softer yeah. ones, um, which again is just, it's, oh, he's got skills, isn't he? <laughs> right, last Lucas. What did I get to? 95? 95. One of the best videos we did were with um, Lee Cox, remember them? Yeah. Lee speed. Yeah. And when he said it's training, no different than practicing your putting, I just thought, no one's ever really said that to me. No. And yeah, that's so obvious. My putting was good because I practiced it loads. My driving was good because I hit a lot of drives. Did I ever practice going faster? No. Some speed pretty rubbish. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's called logic, isn't it? I don't think that's that much faster. 187 carry, 127 ball, 91. So look at that, that's Still interesting. Still a lot, isn't it? Isn't it? Still a yeah, lot. well my Still gaming fiver, and I'm a bit warmer now. So that's my gaming shot. 120 ball speed, 85, you know, I'm 85, 86. Yeah. I'm running on panic push mode. Yeah, yeah, I used to like Lucas. Don't think I'm gonna follow him again. Nah, nah. Get, get back with Burnt. Burnt does the same. The doesn't, oh, wraps right. it as well. Just don't bother going. Yeah, I might not. <laughs> Stay here with me. Or <laughs> well, go and play golf with Dad. I might follow Dad at his next event. <laughs> <laughs>